my home is gone. For generations, my ancestors warred, prospered, and developed to make life better for everyone. But over time, this prosperity turned into greed and corruption. We became divided, those who came before, and people like me, who are new. I stood with my people for years as we grew to power to stop the unfairness and corruption in our society. But there were those among us who didn't want to solve problems and instead manipulated us to take revenge. Then the war began and everything changed. All systems stable and coming back online. Fold engines powering down. Perimeter shields up. Is there a ship in the area? Negative, sir. Nothing on scanners. So, we've beaten them here. How much longer until they arrive? Any moment now. Then we'll wait. out. Come on, hold together. Engine temperatures are rising. I still can't believe we got out of there. Locked, loaded, and ready to engage on arrival. Easy tank. We're not even sure if they've tracked us this far. Given our luck, I'd say it's better to be prepared for anything. Buckle up, everyone! We're exiting fold space in three, two... One. Engines are cooling, systems are rebooting. Good work, team. How many others do you think made it out? I don't know. Scanning the perimeter now. Looks all clear. It's not over yet. You're sure this is the place? Okay, then. This is it. Let's secure close orbit to the planet and begin our scans, quadrant by quadrant. See if we pick up any... anomalies. Roger that. Doesn't look very special to me. It looks... blue. Nova ship coming right at us! It's an ambush! Not if I can help it. Bit of fuel to get here. 
booting up our weapons now. Elrek charging. It's too late. They're on top of us. Incoming transmission from them. Let's see what they say. trying to get away from you. No. At best, you're fugitives escaping justice. At worst, you're spreading your corruption beyond our home. We cannot allow this. Every weapon our ship has is trained on you. We should annihilate the whole lot of you immediately. We're looking for one of our own. A Nova is on board your ship. We've been tracking your ship ever since you left port, which was the last known location of this Nova. Why are you looking for him? I don't need to unpack that for you. Only know that if you release this Nova to us, we will consider letting you go. Sorry, not here. Bye! Jamek! I'm sorry, I got jumpy! They've got him on that ship. Ready the weapons and take aim. Reconnect the transmission. What do we do now? Make a run for it? No. We're dead if we don't respond. We know you have the Nova. Hand him over or we'll destroy you. It's okay, everyone. be able to stay here long. What's wrong? This is... This is crazy! What am I doing? I shouldn't even be here! We wouldn't even be doing this if your people just listened! Everything would have been fine! Forget about it, then. Go on without me. What? No! I can't just leave you here. Why not? Because I don't know what they'll do to you if they find you again. Why are you helping me? You didn't do anything wrong. It's... I don't know. This isn't right, what we're doing now. 
What do you think changed? I... I'm not really sure. I don't recognize my people anymore. They're looking for me. Are they treating you well? Where are your chains? Huh? Your chains? You are their prisoner, aren't you? Why else would you be there? I'm here under my own free will. Coward! Traitor! Now, now! Isn't that interesting? Perhaps the stakes of the situation just aren't clear enough to you. Status, locked on target. If you're not a prisoner, and you clearly no longer prescribe to the goals of our people, I guess that would make you a defector. So I'll make my offer only one more time, core boss. Hand over the defector, and we'll let you live. Maybe we should do what he says. He's lying. Maybe you're lying. I'm not. If you hand me over, they'll destroy all of you, without thinking twice. So we're dead either way. Maybe we should vote on it. Jamek. Look, we're not trying to hurt anyone. We just want to find a new home on this planet and leave the Novas alone. Please, let us go. You mean, let you go again? I don't think so, Maxim. Please. You know as well as I that we've waited long enough for real change. But the power you stand with won't understand any message unless it's written in fire! <laughs> My cold, rusted body. Jamek! Damn it! Realigning targeting parameters. Now what? Where to? Our only chance is to get to the planet's surface as fast as we can. We might be able to lose them in the clouds. Catching up to us! Locked and loaded. Let's see what this baby can really do. at the atmosphere. Buckle up, everyone! See them. What about our ships? Are you kidding? If we launch now, our ships won't last a second in this heat. No kidding. Our shields are draining fast. Heavy artillery it is. Got 
All right. Nice shooting, Tank. Incoming! Engines one and four are down. I'm losing control. Uh-oh. Engine power is going out. Atmospheric friction is increasing. Our weapons are at risk. Retract them. We'll finish them off once we're through. Not yet. We're moving too fast. What's down there? Under the clouds? I don't know. The scanner's coming up blank. We won't last a second if we evacuate while their ship's on our tail. We've got to stop them somehow. The Elbrac's fully charged. Oh, 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 if we can slow the spinning, I'll get a big shot at him. And I do mean big. Leave that to me. The Elbrac? <laughs> Just you wait. Long range energy cannon. It can blast through anything. We're only gonna get one shot at this. As soon as it's outside the ship, the cannon's gonna start breaking up. <laughs> no pressure. It's now or never, tank. Still rolling too fast. On it. Come on, tank. You got this. We gotta land a shot. Ugh. I think we're okay for now. I see. I just don't get it. If the Corbot elites weren't so greedy and corrupt, we wouldn't be here in the first place. Oh, I'm afraid you're right. What? Our leaders never did enough for your people. I see what you see, too. Our society, while great, has always leaned towards sustaining power for only a few. We were trying to stop that. But every time we raised the issue, we were dismissed. I know. When we built your kind, as our forebearers built us, it was always done to improve ourselves. This time, though, things are different. We don't talk to each other anymore. No, we don't. 
And I don't see how any of this is going to solve our problems. We're just taking power for ourselves and destroying everything that isn't us. This isn't what I wanted. One of the things I've learned in all my years is how quickly and eagerly a victim will become the bully when given the opportunity. I don't know what to do. I don't know where I can go. Here, take this. surface readings. Water! Endless water! Wait! I know how we can save the ship. How? We can use the water to soften our landing. That doesn't sound right. At this speed, it will be like crashing into a solid rock. I know, but can we slow down? Fifteen thousand units and dropping. We have our auxiliary engines. They're only good for short bursts, but I think you're on to something, Maxim. Tank, Janik, head down to the engines and prep them. You might have to adjust them manually. Go! Ten thousand! Gearing, on my signal, we'll fire all engines with everything we've got. If we're lucky, We'll have just enough power to slow our descent, and we'll land in one piece. Hopefully. Power is transferring now! We're going to have to time this perfectly, Maxim! Five thousand units! Engines are ready. stabilizing at 500 units. Primary engines are destroyed. We are unable to reach orbit. I see. Prepare a distress signal. Communications are offline too. 
They have been ever since we approached the planet. Something is interfering with us. Our mission of fighting hate and corruption is nearly complete. This group of rogues, perhaps the last, accompanied by one of our own, shakes us deeply. I share your pain and sorrow at this news. But we must remember that all of us have a responsibility to speak our truth and enact our justice. Send out a full 360 reconnaissance sweep and ready the transference cockpit. Engineers, begin repairing the engines right away. For the rest of you, we have one simple goal. Send the defector and the rest of these worthless rust bots to the bottom of the ocean. Calm down, Jamek. Hey, unlike you, I'm not looking to rust up anymore. Come on, how are we doing? All sealed up. Lower decks are ready to vent. Venting? Hope you stole your valuables. still without power. Now what do we do? Engines 1 and 4 are totally waterlogged. Even if we restore full power, there's no way we're taking off again. So we're stuck here. Looks like it. At least our weapons are working. We might be able to push through the water if Dawn gets some power back. Why is all this happening? You know, it wasn't too long ago when things were fine. I know what happened. They got fashionable to dump on us. They've been doing it ever since they broke away from our rituals. Well, it's not like we did them any favors. We never explained ourselves. So then why is Maxim here? Beats me. I think they see him as a threat. Till now, every Nova we've seen has been trying to scrap us. Maxim's different. And maybe the rest of the Novas are scared. Maybe. You know what? I'm gonna stretch my circuits a bit. This stuff is so old. How in the world did we land in one piece? This place was built to last, what can I say? You noobs never really understood that. Also, don't touch that. You could blow up the ship. Oh, sorry. So, where are we with power? We can repair the engines and engage the amphibious casings. But we won't be running at full strength unless we can find another power cell. We... 
the Novas. Use these two. There's plenty of these on board their ships. Like the one that followed us here? Yeah. Well, maybe you could call and ask nicely for them to drop one off. If they're still alive. I'm sorry. I just don't think the others trust you yet. I don't know if I do either. Why not? Think about it. Your kind are eradicating our people. My people. Our friends, family, everyone we've ever loved are being destroyed by the Novas. Then you show up and lead us here? I'm doing the best I can. I know. We're all very thankful for your help, but why are you helping us? I don't know. I'm not going back to my people. Helping you is the right thing to do. Why you and no one else? Aren't there others? <sighs> they won't listen. Or they're scared. Before I found all of you, I tried to save another Korbot. Someone... else? We hid in the city for a while. He wasn't like what I expected. He gave me this. This is one of our library networks. It contains everything. Our history, rituals, stupid jokes, our stories. I thought these were all destroyed. He gave you this? He said that we must rescue the wisdom of the past. Rescue the wisdom of the past? Well, this is certainly one way to do it. When I took this, it was showing me all kinds of things, including the way to get here. We're here, on this planet, because of this thing? Yeah, this library, and where we are, this must have some kind of meaning. I don't think it's an accident we're here now. Hmm. Before the war, did you know of our stories? A bit. Not all of them. Do you believe in them? Not really. But I know their worth. Tell you what, if we get through this, I'll tell you my favorite. <laughs> Deal. That other Corbot. What happened to him? Where is he now? Great, now what? What's going on? A Nova Scout ship has entered scanner range. That means they're still out there. And they found us. Oh no you didn't. Nice shooting tank. Are there more incoming? Not that I can tell, but that won't last long. Don's right. You can bet that ship's at a signal. There will be more coming. Lots more. So now what do we do? 
Last I heard, our power core is out of juice. We can't move this bucket. Yeah. And there's only one place on this planet where there's more power. Alright, it looks like the Nova ship is still out there. They're probably having engine troubles too, otherwise we'd have seen them by now. The first phase of their attack will likely be a mix of fighters and bombers. They'll try to soften us up. This old clunker has been around since the assembly war. It'll hold them off, but I'm not sure how much damage our guns alone will do. Some, but we can't all stay here. We're going to have to go out there and fight. Eventually, they'll bring in the mothership. Armed and ready to finish us off. They really are going to die out here. If we don't get a new power cell, yes, we're dead in the water. But I know where we can find another one. Where? Aboard that ship. That's a suicide mission. Let's just hop in our fighters and get out of here. The sooner we leave, the better. But where would we go? Our fighters don't have any instruments or power to get us far. Everything we need is here. Dawn's right. Our only chance is to save this ship. I know they're up there, hundreds of them. Maxim, we're not gonna let you do that alone. Not just me. It's gonna take all of us. Okay. What's your plan? We hold off their attacks. Draw the Nova Mothership in close enough for me to get inside, steal a power cell, then escape. Oh, you can't be serious. The only way we're going to survive is if we get a new power cell. In the lower decks, on the third level, is the power center. There's an auxiliary hangar nearby I can use to land. Okay, fine. I'll go. What? Damn it, no. This is my people's ship. You'll be spotted in an instant. Hey, speak for yourself, buddy. I don't know if you've looked in the mirror lately, but you're not looking yourself either. I'm small. I can get places you can't. You'd be far too slow. They won't even know I was there. All right. But I'll be on comms to guide you through everything. Everyone else good with the plan? We're with you, Maxim. <laughs> Locked and loaded.
Locked and loaded. Hey, that's my line. <laughs> What is it? When the time is right, it will help you to lead the Corbots to safety. Together, we can save the wisdom of the past. Take him. No. Step aside, or we'll destroy you two. No. What's your color, Nova? Maxim. Maxim? You've taken a name? And you are willing to die for that tin can? Yes, I am. No, son. What are you doing? Don't do this! It's okay. Remember what I told you. We'll be on the right side of history when this is over, Corbot! A history written by you. Remember what I told you. You know, the first line states for us not even to talk to them anymore. Do you know why we have these? It's what brings us together, Maxim. We're all now a family because of the connection it forms between us. It strengthens us, validates us, and allows us to progress. We're destroying our cities. This is not progress. Can't you see we're in a crisis? Look around you. For the first time in forever, we are finally acting as a united people. We might look the same, but that doesn't mean you speak for me. <laughs> when was the last time you even educated yourself? Need I remind you that they were the ones who interfered first, telling us how to live? I know. But our culture, our history, everything our peoples have ever known, built on bigotry and a corrupt foundation. It's worthless. It will be wiped away with the rest of the core bots. It's not who we are anymore, nor the kind of world we want for the future. What kind of future? A future free of corruption and hate, of course. Where our people can be taught tolerance and justice can be had by all. That's not what we... what you're doing. We hated them for their corruption, their bullying. 
We wanted to stop it, but now we're the ones. Oh, the please. They brought us We're supposed to be solving problems. How is any of this They had the chance to act for you. We're marching down the street, rounding up Corbots, tearing down everything. It should be torn down. This needs to stop. Where is the line anymore? I know this all seems painful, but we must stand up for what we believe in. What? Did you do? Everyone hear me okay? Crystal clear. Yep. Sure can. Uh-huh. Listen, everyone. The Novas have the advantage in every way, except one. They have the high ground. They outnumber us, and their weapons are advanced. But they also have nothing to offer. They have ripped down everything, good and bad, that makes us who we are. And they would sooner vaporize our world than take the time to fix it. Many of my people don't seem to understand this, and I don't know if they ever will. The Novas are now the very thing they're supposed to be fighting against. We're here on this planet for a reason. I believe our future is linked to discovering its secrets. But first, we must survive. We're with you, Maxim. 100%, buddy. Totally! Eh, uh, we're dead. A squadron of Nova fighters just entered scanner range. All right, everyone. Hold tight. Shoot, don't you, Don? Bet I can scrap more than you, hotshot. Oh, you got yourself a deal. Wait for my signal, Don.
are out! Here she comes. Everyone tighten and form up on me. It's time to punch through. Above the engine bays are two emergency runways. Jared, you can land there. Follow me. Got it. While you're inside, the rest of us will keep them occupied. That might be easier said than done. some dangerous readings from your ship. Get back here! I can keep going! We need you back here. Alive! Please, Maxim! Don't worry about us, Maxim. We got it from here. the nearest maintenance vent and go inside. Copy that. Sir, the power. 
power shift overloaded the circuits, making the power grid unstable. What does that mean? Any other kind of electrical disruption could start a chain reaction of power surges. It could bring the whole ship down. As long as our shields aren't at risk, we're fine. Keep firing. Where are you going? The defector must die. Sir, you know this machine is only for- I know the code! I understand. Thank you. You have always been the strongest ally. Not sure how much longer we can hold them off. You done in there yet, Jamek? Working on it. Jamek. Where are you? It's Grand Fino. There's lots of tombs and yeah. Got some gunk on me. Thermal pace. You're close. Find a safe place to exit. Copy that. Maxim, I'm getting some power fluctuations on the main batteries. What do you need? Can you go check it out? I think some wires are crossed. Okay. It's down on level three where we were before. Let me know when you're there. Justice requires sacrifice. I, you're sacrificing everything! You've forgotten who you are. 
Show me why you resist. I can hear you, Jamie. Did you find a power cell? You're breaking up. Are you out? Help! Find a way back to your ship, Jamie. I'm coming to get you. Maxim, come in. Did you find the problem? Maxim? Are you down here? Max! Surrender. Oh yeah? Says you and what army? Oh. I said no, dirtbot! Hey, that's not very nice. What do you say you just roll with it? Need a ride? <laughs> oh, yeah! Man, I love that hopper. We'll build you another one. Freeze right there! Activate the hangar defenses! Hold on, buddy! Jam again to power cell. We're on our way back. We're coming in hot. What's going on? Why aren't we firing? 
Sir, it, it appears a Corbot snuck aboard and sabotaged our power core, causing a power surge. We only have enough power to stay aloft. It's worse than that. If we don't start damage control immediately, then the ship will lose all power and will crash. We need the drones back on board. Ah! Recall every drone and fix the problem now! I want that rust bucket blown out of the ocean! You seeing this? What? The Novas. They're retreating. They're regrouping. you. You're back just in time. Take a look. Why did they fall back? I'm not sure. But it looks like their ship is heavily damaged. We should finish them off while their backs are turned. You've taken a lot of damage, too. We don't have much to fight with. But they're out of commission. So are we, Jamek. We might as well lob rocks at them. Gearing's right. When they get their power back, we'll be no match. We have to get out of here while we still can. So what do we do? Fire up the engines and get as far away as we can. Where are we gonna go? Look around. I don't know. What happened to you, Maxim? Yes! Awesome! All right! The damage report, sir. It's extensive. Start the repairs immediately. We can't let them get too far away. There. Like it never even happened. More or less. Thanks. What happened down there? One of the Novas connected to me and tried to take control. Novas can do that? They're not supposed to. I have no choice. How do you feel? More lonely. All I ever wanted was to fight for change. Real change. 
But now all I want is to go home. You know, leaving your people and coming to save us was the most Nova thing you could have done. They always say they stand up for what they believe in. They just never thought it would be against them. Well, considering what just happened, I'd say I owe you a story. Seriously? Absolutely. And I bet this can help us. Hmm. Ah, here it is. Long ago, there was a village. The people of this village were peaceful, but lived in fear of a great beast that roamed the land. One day, a hero heard the plight of the villagers and came to them, promising he would slay the beast. He went out to the hills above, and with the entire village witnessing, triumphed over the beast. The hero was never seen again. Peace finally came to the village, as well as the story of the great hero who defeated the mighty beast. Those who heard the story cried out that they would have stopped the beast too if given the chance. They impatiently went out in search of their own beast to slay, but could not find one. All the beasts were slain time would pass, and their impatience turned into anger when they could not find beasts outside their walls. They began to call fellow villagers beasts and attack them. Fear had returned to the village. Then, the great hero returned too and was distraught at what he saw. I slayed the beast so that you might live. Why do you squander this gift to fight amongst yourselves? He asked. The villagers, realizing the wisdom of his words, stopped. In their vanity, they were all becoming the very beasts they sought to slay. Thanks for looking out for me. I thought we lost you. Something's happening. I've never seen that before. What direction are we headed? Not sure yet. Do we have a port for this? What is that? I think that's our heading. On it. Hey, why do you say we lower the bridge shields?
Hello, and thank you for watching Torn Seas, a solo 3D animated film project made entirely in Unreal Engine. Torn Seas can best be explained by one of its goals, which is to create a feature-length film using a special set of animation techniques and workflows called cinematic design. What is cinematic design? It's a method of animation and cinematic content creation that relies entirely on using a real-time engine to work with. Unlike traditional animation workflows where you're typically constrained by your artistic ability and tedious processes, cinematic design allows you to set your quality and speed bar higher, limited only by the tools, assets, and other resources available. Real-time engines like Unreal Engine contain various tools for video game production, but these same tools can be reapplied to support cinematic content creation. The better you understand these tools, the higher quality your content can be, and the faster you can make it. Although the cinematic design process enabled Torn Seas to be created very efficiently, it still required a not insignificant amount of funding to complete, most of which was self-provided. This typically took the form of contracting various artists to create 3D models, motion capture, and voice acting. This was necessary since Torn Seas is an original story which requires many new and unique assets outside of my expertise. If you enjoyed the film, I would like to ask if you could make a donation to my channel. This would go a long way in recouping the costs it took to make Torn Seas. You can donate to me either by clicking thanks or by navigating to my Ko-fi page and donating to me there. Also, if you are interested in the cinematic design process, I will be releasing a series of posts, images, and videos for those who subscribe to my Patreon, which is linked in this video's description. Through Torn Seas, I would like to teach you these cinematic design workflows and provide insight into how Torn Seas was made. It's a fundamentally different and unique way of making movies that maximizes speed, efficiency, and cost effectiveness without sacrificing quality. The process is very intuitive and easy to learn. Anyone can be a cinematic designer, and you don't need specific skill sets. You don't need to be a 3D artist, animator, or modeler to make movies with this approach. I don't even consider myself to be a very good animator. So, if you're interested in either the making of this film, or want to learn more about the specific animation and cinematic workflows used to make it, you can become a member on my Patreon. Once again, thank you for watching my film. I hope you enjoyed it. If so, please consider leaving a donation on my channel. I will be using the response from this video to explore doing more films in the future. Thank you and take care.